Hey, what's up? This is Chris from The Longest Way. I just returned home after the Taiwan thingy. I'm here for a couple of presentations. And um, I'm wearing my Descendant shirt, so that's good. And now down here is um, a poster of the, of the Silk Road that I put up here. See if I can focus, yeah, here it is. So, it's one of those times where we get to make the line a little bit longer. So here in Samarkand, that was in, uh, I don't even know when, when was that? Like in, in, in March or something? And then I walked uh, here through Katakurgan, which was a place where they had a hotel, but they wouldn't let me sleep because it was for military only. So then I went to Navoi. Navoi was the place where I stayed for like four days in a, um, in a nice hotel with a nice balcony, with two balconies actually, and I, I tried to get a tan. And then I ran into the police after when I took uh, photos around a, an industrial area and there was a prison there apparently. So they were unhappy. And then I walked up here to Gizduban and then into Bukhara. And Bukhara was really nice and I stayed there. And then I took uh, like four days or something and I walked all the way to the border to here. And I put the caboose there, then I went back, let's see if we can find it. I went all the way back because I wouldn't get the, um, the visa for, for Turkmenistan. And I stayed here. Let's see where. Here. Uh, there's actually a little dot there. Right there. Kajisai. And I stayed there on the lake shore for like three months or something. And I waited for the visa, and then when it, when they it gave me the visa, bam, I went back. And finally, 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 started walking again. And I walked through Turkmenistan, through all of this here. Let's see if we can do that. Da -da 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 into Mari. And I took the northern way here, I think. No, here, yeah. And all the way here, through Mari. And then uh, I stayed one night in Mali, and I walked around, around the lake. Then I had to make a little turn back here. And then I was in Saras, and then I was in Iran. So now we're in Iran already. I did all this in 15 days, the whole Turkmenistan thing. So, okay, so Iran it is. I stayed for like five days there. And then I walked through these little villages. Let's see if I can find it. And here it was really bad with a mountain at Mastaban. And, but yeah, nothing to do but continue walking. And then I came into Mashhad. Let's see, where is... Yeah, Mashhad should be this thing here. So that's where I am now. Mashhad. Yeah. So this is fun. <laughs> Making the line a little bit longer. I love this hair. Doesn't really look that long, does it? Or maybe it does. I don't know. But there's um, there's all these memories, you know, Cobra Country here. And uh, yeah, Nang, the little dog, was here. Where I cried. And uh, here was, um, right before Mashad was Hassan and his family that took me in. Yeah, and so now the next plan is to go here through Kuchan, Bojnor, and uh, along the Caspian Sea here, and then go all the way up. Man, I'm always going out of focus, am I? Sorry. <laughs> yeah. All the way up here and into Baku. 
I don't know how that's going to play out, but that's the plan. So yeah, um, good to be home. And um, good to be through the bottleneck of Turkmenistan. If uh, everything plays out, Iran is going to give me the next visa and then I'm going to go back. I don't know, maybe before Christmas or maybe after Christmas. I'm kind of thinking maybe after Christmas. Stay Christmas here. Um, work on growing that belly. You know, need some winter uh, cushioning. And uh, yeah, then go back and continue working. Have a good day. Do debts and dudes. And I'll see you. Peace.